is up guys Jason Rosenka here today I'm gonna to be talking about I did a previous video on people gaining weight and in working out and why why you gain weight and you can kind of look at that, that video that I did on that and it'll explain a little bit more on, on the reasons why um, you know physically and you know why your body will gain weight when you work out so today I'm gonna to be talking about what you can do about it so we know what the reasons why you're gaining weight and now I'm going to talk about what you can do about it. For, the, for those of you guys who don't know who I am, my name is Jason Rosinka, and I am a, I'm a nurse, I'm a dad, and health and fitness coach. And this is a common question I get, and it's, it's frustrating for a lot of us. And the number one thing I can tell you guys about, about gaining weight is, is simply stop doing it. Stop weighing yourself. Especially if this is something that's either getting you super frustrated enough that you quit, or enough that you don't even get started. If you've done it before and you don't even get started working out, just say, screw it. Uh, the last time I did that, I gained weight, so what's the point of working out? Um, that is the wrong reason to, to be quitting or not to be working out at all. Um, I told you what the reasons are, and, and that is a bad reason to stop or quit uh, <clears throat> or not even get started. Uh, what I want you guys to do is to, to think about your goals. So you're more than just a number. Uh, if you think that your weight should be 135 and everything's going to be, you're going to be happy at 135, you know, why, why is that? Why is that magic number? Um, I've had a ton of people that think that that's their goal and, and they hit 135 and it's like, now what do you do? Uh, so you need to re be realizing what, what that's, that goal is and how it's going to make you feel more so than just that number. Um, when people say my goal is to be 135, I, I want to know why. Why do you want to be 135? And how is that going to make you feel? Are you going to feel better in your clothes is number one. Um, are you going to feel stronger? Are you going to feel um, like you have more energy? Are you going to feel more healthy? Um, I don't want to f hear just a, a number and no other goals besides that. Um, really, I don't really care about numbers when you're talking about goals. I think those other things that I listed should be more important. Um, so, and, and one th another thing that you need to realize too is if you're not reaching your goals, if you're gaining weight continuously, really, really look deep into what your nutrition is. Um, is your nutrition 100% dialed in? Um, 70 to 80% of results that we get from, from working out or eating or, or reaching those goals that you guys have is all about what you put in your mouth. And are you dialed in 100%? Uh, and only you know that. Uh, not everybody's gonna know what you're eating unless they're with you 24 seven. So that's something that you're gonna know and that's something that you need to dial in and you need to, to really 100% say that I'm doing everything I can. I'm eating everything perfectly. Um, great food, no, no junk food, uh, no alcohol, no whatever, whatever your goals are. And if you're doing that, then there's, there might be some other things that we can dial in. But usually that's it. Um, if you're not eating right, you're not going to feel right and you're not going to get to your goals. So hopefully this helped you out guys. Just a, just a little bit of stuff on, on gaining weight and working out. Don't get frustrated. Throw your scale in the garbage and just start feeling better and eating better and working out and being happy. All right, guys, peace. Remember to play our neat well.